Hi everybody, Paul here. Today I'm going to show you how to replace a right front steering rack boot on a 2006 Toyota Camry. I picked up this boot on eBay with free shipping for $11. This is a genuine OEM Toyota. Make sure you observe all safety precautions when you're working underneath a car. Here's the boot we're going to replace right here. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this area here on the nut and on the arm with nail polish remover or acetone. Once the acetone dries, I'm going to mark the bolt and the arm with an indelible marker. The reason we put the line on is so when we put it back together, we don't lose our wheel alignment. Next, we need to take out this cotter pin. Next, we need to take off this 17 millimeter nut. Now we've got to lift this arm out. Now you want to count how many turns it takes for this to come off. One, two, three, four, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then with a 14 millimeter wrench holding this arm, I'll have to remove this 19 millimeter nut off the rest of the way. Next we'll have to remove this clamp on the boot on the small end. So on the other end of the boot, there is a clamp you'll have to cut off and then remove the entire boot section. So the only way I was able to get this strap off on the other end of the boot was I took a screwdriver and put it on that section right there and then I tapped the other end of the screwdriver with a hammer and it came off. So here you can see how bad the old one was cracked. It needed to be replaced to keep debris and dirt out of the system. So now I'm going to pack some more grease in here. This boot can be really tight to get on on the large end, so first try stretching it. Put a little grease on the inside of the boot, which will help it slip on. And then go ahead and slip on your new boot. Then once you get your boot on, then fasten the large end down with either a metal tie or a plastic zip tie, like I have here. And then clamp the small end. And then go ahead and just put everything back together. Then put a crescent wrench on this section, and with your 19 millimeter wrench, snug it back down and line up the lines. I hope you found this helpful, and if you like this video, please hit the like button below, share it with your friends, and please be sure to subscribe. God bless you and have a great day. Bye for now.